Hepinize merhaba arkadaşlar Dream Park kanalıma hoş geldiniz. Ben Ataberk. Bugün sizlerle Brave Wilderness adlı bir kanalı inceleyeceğiz. Brave Wilderness kanalında şimdi bir adam vahşi doğada mesela First Animal Bites videosuna girelim. What's going on, Cardi Pack? Well, as we all know, I take a lot of bites, stings, and pinches to make this show possible. And this past week, I took the most painful pinch I've ever received, and it came from a giant Dungeons crab. Arkadaşlar, şimdi diyor ki geçen hafta mükemmel bir ısırık videosu çektim. Bir mıncıklandım diyor. Bir yengeç tarafından diyor. And just in case you missed that episode, let's take one more look. I'm Cody Peterson, and I'm about to enter the pinch zone with the dungeon. It's crab. Ready? Let's do it. One, two, here we go. Three. Ah! Oh! Ooh, that's pretty bad. Ah! Ah! Can you see that? Oh, he's got my finger locked in there. Oh, it's like right on the joint. Oh my gosh, the teeth are definitely just digging into my finger. Arkadaşlar siz olsanız dayanabilir miydiniz buna? Ben dayanamazdım. Oh, hold on, the bait. Bu yengeçlerin e, kıskaçları yiyecekleri daha kolay tutabilmek elinden bırakmamak için kullanılıyormuş. <gülüyor> Pointer finger really took a hit on that one, but the good news Çok is that there was no broken bone. Now people also want to know, falan. Coyote, what's worse, the pinches, the bites, or the stings? Ow, ow, that's a good question. Let's talk about each of those. Now, when it comes to pinches, pinches are bad and they hurt. When it comes to something like the crab, it's pressing down on your skin and on the bone. Yeah, the pain is. Ve adam çok büyük bir yengeçe sokturuyor kendini. Baksanıza, normal yengeç bile benim canımı acıtır. Eğer soktursam tabii öyle bir şey yapmam. Delilik yani. It's, it's pretty intense, but it only lasts for a couple of minutes. Once my finger or whatever yazın, the body part is in the pincher of an animal is out of the pincher, the pain usually resides in just a few minutes. Now, when it comes to bites, there's two different kinds. There's bites from animals that do not have venom, and then there's bites from animals that do have venom. Now, you've seen me bitten by a giant alligator snapping turtle, and of course, we all remember when I stuck my arm into the mouth of an alligator. And yes, there was a little bit of blood, swelling, and some bruising, but at the end of the day, it really wasn't that bad. Now, when you get a bite from something that's venomous, like the Gila monster, that hurts big Big time. He bit me. Sure. Yeah, he definitely bit me. Oh, uh, yeah, he got the whole top of my thumb. Not only did the teeth cut the skin and cause a lot of bleeding, but once the venom goes into your system, that's where the pain really begins. So an animal that bites you with venom, really, really bad. And I know a lot of you have asked Coyote, will you be bit by a rattlesnake? No, absolutely. Arkadaşlar, o şimdi timsahın acısı bir anda başlıyormuş. Absolutely not. And as we know, it's not bitten intentionally by the Gila monster. That was a mistake, and that's because I got the GoPro camera a little too close to the face of the Gila monster. Definitely learned my lesson there. Now the stings are without question the worst, and that's because with every sting, venom enters the equation. Now I've been stung by scorpions before, and that's pretty painful. Ah! Jeez. Yep. Got me. However, it's the ant stings that I've received that have been the worst. The harvester ants specifically formed a bunch of large welts on my arm that itched for days. But I think we all know it was the fire ants that did the most damage. 300 sting. Adamın böyle sapa sağlam bir vücuda sahip olması çok şans biliyorsunuz değil mi arkadaşlar? Çok çok büyük şansı var. Verimli sadakası var arkadaşlar. Ya çünkü düşünsenize böyle böcekler kolunuzu ısırıyor falan sokuyor size yılanlar sokuyor ve ölmüyorsunuz yani. 
Biraz garip bir şey, garip bir durum. Things on my hands, and for weeks I had little white pustulates. They were swollen and itchy. Aa. If there's one thing that I have learned, it is definitely to never put my hands into a mound of fire ants again. This is much worse than the horror story ants. But there is something worthwhile that's coming out of these episodes. Not only are we getting an education about the animals that a lot of us fear, but I'm also giving you a first-hand, no pun intended, perspective of what it's like to have some of these encounters. My real goal. Video sunuyor musun arkadaşlar? Sunuyor sonra oturuyor kendini. Ciddi. Harbiden bir sürü sürü episodes is that you guys out there will watch them. Then go out into the wild and see a scorpion or a gila monster or an alligator and then say to yourself, ooh, I know that that sting or bite can be very, very painful and potentially deadly, so I'm going to just admire this animal from a safe distance. I'm Kennedy Peterson and I'm about to enter the strike zone with the leaf cutter ant with the dungeon. It's crazy. Arkadaşlar zaten videoda bitti mi isteyecek son iki dakikası. Biz yavaş yavaş videomuzu kapatalım. Böyle daha farklı tepki videoları yani bazı kanalları incelebilir. İstiyorsanız alta. Zeynep'le birlikte inceleyeceğiz. E, Altaya yorum olarak yazabilirsiniz. Ve e, o yorumları beğenin ki üste doğru çıksın ve biz onları daha rahat görebilelim. Arkadaşlar beğendiyseniz like atmanızı çok isterim. Bir dahaki videolarda görüşmek üzere. Hoşçakalın.